simplify these radical expressions in one of my favorite ways. I like to call this breaking out of prison. So the way that we break out of prison is since these are square root prisons, we need to find couples that break out of prison. So we take the number 63 and we break it down as far as we can. What numbers do you know that multiply together to be 63? Let's say 9 and 7. So we've broken down, six, broken down 63 into 9 and 7. 9 breaks down further into 3 and 3. Now why the fourth also breaks down? It becomes a y, 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 y. Now, to simplify the radical, we circle the pairs which escape from prison. So we get a pair of 3's, a pair of y's, a pair of y's, and left in the prison is the number 7. And so after we simplify here and multiply out, we get 3y squared radical 7. And that's the final answer. To see it one more time, let's take 18u to the 8th under a radical. Now 18 is 6 times 3, and 6 is 2 times 3 u to the 8th is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8 u's. So how many pairs do we get this time? Well, we get a pair of 3's. We get 1, 2, 3, 4 pairs of u's. So I'll write down u to the 4th. And then who's left in prison? But the 2 by itself. And so the final answer to this problem would be 3 u to the 4th square root of 2. Now try this one on your own. Square root of 50 x to the 22nd power. And assuming you paused for a moment and tried it on your own, 50 of course would be 5 times 10 and 10 would be 5 times 2. Now for the x to the 22 I'm actually not going to write out 22 x's. I know you were hoping that I would. But I'm just going to recognize that since I was pairing them in the previous problems, that just simply means that at the end I'm going to be left with x to the 11, because for x to the 22, that's 11 pairs of xx, 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 etc. over and over. What number is left? Well, it looks like there'd be a 5 that has a pair, so there's a 5 that is in the, on the outside. And then as far as what's left on the inside, there would be a 2 left on the inside. So the final answer to this problem, hopefully you got the same thing, would be 5x to the power of 11 square root 2.